Hello, everybody, and welcome to uh, Chapter 3 in Chasm. Um, as you can see, my save game is gone. Uh, they've updated to 0 0.42, and with that, they've wiped out save games. Uh, unfortunately, um, there was actually a notice when I first loaded it up that mentioned um, that save games were, were wiped, um, which is nice of them to, to mention, I guess. But, uh, you know, uh, it is an alpha game, so that should be expected. Uh, I would much prefer that they, you know, don't worry that much about uh, restoring save games, uh, and they just worry about getting the, the game worked on. Um, I imagine porting save games across, especially depending on what you change, pardon me, is, is kind of a big deal. Um, you know, uh, I guess I've never written anything nearly as complicated as this, uh, so I don't know for sure, but I think I also screwed up my name last time, uh, so that's a good reason to restart. Uh, we'll go with that. Um, once again, uh, as you see this warning here, it is an alpha, so don't be surprised if there are bugs or issues, although I haven't run into anything yet. Um, I haven't had any crashes, haven't had any uh, major glitches or anything, really. Uh, it, it's, it's actually been fairly flawless so far, which is pretty good fairly impressive. But I have to start over. So uh, I believe last time we left off I was fighting oh I forget its name but it was a it was like a I don't know a boss of some kind. Anyway uh, we killed the troll and unlocked the elevator and explored a bunch of stuff. Uh, where's my mind key? Oh, I should go get my bandana. Or my bottle. Oh, no, I can't slide yet. And there's no bandana anymore. Well, that's interesting. Alright, so some stuff has changed, obviously. Actually, I guess the bottle thing is, um... I don't know. Uh, it's kind of a minor change, but that's that's something that uh, resetting the save would affect, I suppose. Let's see if we can <coughs> get through here without uh, eating a whole bunch of spikes. Um, of course, uh, you know the whole map is is reset, but the map is different as well. Uh, it, it does have random map generation, if you weren't already aware of that. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, as far as the new patch, uh, I don't know exactly what they've changed. Um, I'm working on getting alpha, ac uh, alpha forum access. Um, you know, hopefully they've got patch notes, or they, they say they've got patch notes in there. I just uh, don't have access to it yet. Um, there were some issues getting registered, uh, but I've sent them an email and asked them to, to help me out with that. Um, I don't know if I can talk to you guys about the specifics that are in the patch notes. Um, I, I don't see why they would care, but they do have them locked up in, in uh, alpha forms, so perhaps they do care. Uh, you know, so I'll find out about that before I start rattling off a bunch of stuff. Um, you know, although they're they're fine with us streaming it, so I am, I'm going to discover stuff uh, just through the act of, of playing it, uh, where things are different. So I, it, it seems weird to me that they would really care, uh, and they probably don't. But I will check with them before I do anything, uh, because I would like to be respectful. You know that kind of stuff. Um, so anyway, yeah, where were we last time? We were... Oh, I can't remember the name of it. It, it was some werewolf thing. Uh, whoops. I had just killed the... Well, not just, but I'd killed the troll boss. Uh, I killed a bunch of other things. I had jump... Or, uh jump. Jump was the thing I still wanted. I had slide dash unlocked, uh, or slide kick, or whatever you want to call it, uh, and that was pretty cool. I don't think I had anything else really unlocked. I found some pieces of armor, and a new weapon. Oh, I got a giant club. I think that was from the, the, the troll boss, actually. Um, no, so those, those things. Oh, can I level up? This is early. Yeah, I care. Oh, I'm gonna go with the strength build this time. I'm just gonna try and smash all the things. Because doing lots of damage is a lot of fun, right? Get up to the point where I can just one-shot everything. Oh, 
See, I can one-shot that guy now, which is much better than getting stabbed by him first. Uh, you know, a smart guy would just dodge after he attacks him, but apparently I'm not any good at that, so... <clears throat> so it's kind of unfortunate. Uh, I guess we, we had almost two hours into the game. I suppose not quite, uh, because, of course, I had spent a bunch of time failing epically at uh, hardcore mode. Um, you know, so I wasn't quite two hours into the game, but uh, I've lost whatever progress I had. So that's kind of unfortunate. Um, I mean, it's not a big deal. It's, it's it is what it is, anyway. Uh, I'm sure there are plenty more spikes for me to go jump myself into. Um, although so far I'm doing fairly well, which of course now I'm going to fail because I said that. But we'll see what happens. So far, this map seems kind of crazy, a little bit different. I guess at this point what I'm looking for is the, the slide kick, because um, at least last time that seems to be what I needed to unlock to move forward, sort of the next area, to find the troll boss and stuff like that. Uh, so I don't know, I don't even know if, if that stuff is always in the same order, that would be kind of interesting. You know, if, if on one playthrough you unlock slide kick first and you need it to sort of get to the next area, to get to the next power up or whatever. Any other times you unlock uh, whatever jump first. We have here a lifting belt. Yes, please. Uh, sure. Sounds good to me. Yeah, um... I think my train of thought just uh, kind of derailed, crashed through a small village. Hopefully no one was injured, but I don't know what the hell I was just talking about. Oh yeah, uh, if power-ups were in, in different orders, um, the unlockable things that you need sort of to progress. Um, again, I, I don't even know. Uh, slide kick is the only one that I'm sure of, uh, and I'm reasonably sure that there's going to be uh, some kind of extended jump um, because I found some rooms where I, you know, there was a, a ledge I couldn't jump high enough for. But one of those rooms in the, um, the early attempts, I don't, it might have been in one of the hardcore attempts, I'm not sure, uh, or it could have been in the first softcore game. Uh, there was one where I came into it and I couldn't, I couldn't get through it, but then I actually later on came to the other side of it, uh, which does mean that some of them may just be one-way rooms. It may may not be something I can ever, you know, go both ways with. Not quite enough to level up, unfortunately. Oh, hey, elevator guy. All right, so troll is probably down here somewhere. One of those nasty spear dudes. Let's go up. Always take the high ground, right? That's a good strategy. I don't know. Uh, it tells an interesting story of, you know, an old civilization and Triangle Head, uh, as I call him. <laughs> um, I have no idea what his deal is, but I suspect he's the big bad guy. Uh, I think at one point it talked about some temple that uh, Triangle Head and his minions were building. They don't call him Triangle Head, that's just that's what he looks like in pictures, so I call him that. Um, anyway, uh... Yeah, yeah, he's got some temple somewhere, I think. Uh, I think that's what, like, the fifth or sixth note? Uh, cave drawing, whatever you want to call it. Oh, oh spike floor. Oh, dear. Dear, oh, dear. Oh, dear. I'm doing okay. Oh, this is 
slight kick, isn't it? Yes, I remember now. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And a note. Um, like... Okay, spikes, go away. Sweet. So that was fairly quick. We got to that quickly. I don't even think I've found any rooms where I couldn't traverse through without it yet, which is. Lucky, I guess. I. Uh, that, was that just here? Oh, I was just here. Let's go up to that other room and see. Hopefully, there's some more treasure or oh, spikes. Well, it had to happen sooner or later. Jumping in spikes. Ah, teleport it back to That's cool. Let's go buy a bottle and use a fire. I can't remember how much the bottle is. It might be uh, 500, so I don't know if I can buy it yet. But... bottle I can go get with Sly Kick. And she doesn't have one anymore. Oh, so you can't get a bottle right away. You have to unlock Sly Kick first. Well, that's interesting. I don't... I don't want anything with her. I do... Well, we're in good shape here. Um, this actually, it, it feels like it's going much faster than previously, although I guess I know what I'm doing and also jumping in my spikes. So that helps. Are there any nearby rooms? I'm going to go exploring for treasure. Uh, I should... Yeah. I, I apparently picked a perfect path through here. That was some alliteration. Hooray. Uh... You know, when I was going through, uh, I seemed to have gone straight for the thing. It's almost like I knew where it was, but I really didn't, honest. Uh, I mean, it is random map seeds, so um, there's there's no way to know. Um, which is kind of cool. Um, I yeah, I don't know how much I'm going to be playing it. Um, I, you know, there is always hardcore, but... a little too hardcore for me. I, I guess once you get past to the point where you've at least got a, a, a potion bottle, uh, aside from bosses, it's not so bad because you can always just, you know, use potions to heal and then if you get really injured, you can just be like, well, look, I'm going to run all the way back to town. Uh, hopefully not running into a bunch of spikes along the way and, um, you know, refill everything. Um, farm a couple enemies near the beginning if you have to, to get up enough uh, essence to, to refill your potion or potions, um, I'm assuming you can get multiple bottles. Uh, so I did leave a spot back in that first zone and now I'm somewhere completely new with water. Whatever. Oh look. I bet you if I'd gone the other way, <laughs> I would have come out there. Um, I think Troll Boss was behind the water last time, so maybe I'm moving forward rather than trying to treasure, but that doesn't really matter. For the most part. Although I do think I found a piece of armor last time, um, although if I remember right it was an enemy drop. Although I think, yeah, there's Triangle Head. Uh, I think I was building luck last time instead of strength. So that, you know, could make a difference, I'm not sure. Um, I, I don't know how big of a difference luck makes. Um, Certainly vitality doesn't seem to make a lot of difference. I think it gives me like three hit points, which, you know, whatever. Uh, whereas strength gives me a fair bit of attack. Like, you know, three hit points is, what, 5% of my health? That's that's kind of a, a... Oh, I get four. Sorry. So that's, I don't know, whatever, 6.5%. I don't, I, I don't want to do that math right now. Um, 
uh, an int gives me mana, 10% mana, which isn't too bad. It's, it's certainly better than, than the relative increase in health, but uh, I don't have anything to use mana for. Uh, and then luck. Strength gives me a fairly large boost, though. Uh, I don't know what that is, somewhere near 20%, something like that. this room last time, or close to it, no, not right after it anyway, at least not this time. Ah, oh, that flag, that's the boss room flag, I believe. Well, so that's interesting too, so yeah, like, uh, I was talking before about how on hardcore, you know, you might be better off because you've got, um, or you might be okay, better off than sort of I was in my first attempts. Because you get the bottle, you can heal, you can kind of play it safe. And you even get warning uh, about where the bad guy is. So he, he's going to jump at me here, I think. At some point. Maybe not. Yeah, there you go. It's going to be a lot easier when you, I guess, know what to expect from him. get something from him? No. There's all the treasures in here. Oh, elevator wheel, right. So that's good. Yeah, and then hopefully this time uh, I did find um, sort of a new zone last time. Um, I only found like one room of it or whatever that I could go into. There's one of the jump rooms I can't proceed past. Um, it was all uh, like jungly and foresty or something. Um, I don't know. Uh, uh, I don't know what it was called, uh, but that was pretty cool. Uh, it looked neat. Um, you know, I've, I've spent enough time in these sort of dank, dark cave places. Lots interesting. So that's almost like a, a level in hit points. Um, or a vitality worth of hit points. That's kind of cool. I think I got one of those last time for mana, which again I have no use for, but I'm sure something will come along eventually. Um, it'd actually be really cool to get like maybe a heal spell or something, uh, uh, especially so when I do stupid things like that I can fix it. Um, I don't know if mana regenerates, uh, but uh, you know, if it does then Maybe a heal spell would actually be overpowered, I'm not sure. One defense and one int. Um, and as I think I observed before in the last game, these things don't actually, uh, you know, show up on your character yet. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, I'm assuming that that's something that they're working on. Oh, maybe it does. Do I have... Some weird shoulder thing now? No, no, no. Alright. Sorry, just checking. Um, you know, the weapons are different. Um, I had the club, and, and, and it certainly looked like a giant club when I was swinging it. Uh, but the armor and, and whatnot don't show up, like my power belt and uh, not my tabard. Or, sorry, lifting belt, not power belt. Um, I can't remember where that's from, that's like Baldur's Gate or something like that, I don't know. Um, no, I can't level up yet. But, uh, yeah, yeah I, you know, I expect that, that stuff is probably going to show up on your character. Um, well, maybe not, uh, but it would be cool to, to have your guy look a little bit different. Uh, and then run directly into a stupid caterpillar because you're just busy talking to pay attention to what you're doing. Yeah. That's how I roll. Man, I tell ya, I think I complained about, or not complained, but talked about this last 
stream as well, but there is no way that you would get me cave diving. I mean, just just uh, maybe with the scuba gear, but no, not free diving in a cave like ever, unless it's like a you know a one foot long cave. The, just I I don't know about you, but I'm a really big fan of oxygen. Um, you know, almost addicted to it, you might say. Uh, and uh, yeah, I just know. Um, not to mention, I mean, here, you know, that cave is all nice and light blue and stuff to show off the water and everything. But in reality, underwater caves are probably generally fairly dark. So, um, pardon me, I'm getting steam messages. You probably heard the, the thing. I don't think you can see the pop-up, though. I can remember to disable that kind of stuff. My phone. I should probably disable. Put that on silent, too. Treat it like a theater. Where am I going? Uh, down. I want treasure. Treasure, treasure, treasure. Let me... Oh, I can go down even further. Oh, it's because I want to go down even further. Alright, I, mean, I don't mind building up a, a reserve of um, essence, essence it's called in uh, Oh, I can't go there. Yeah, there's enough rooms like that that I don't think it's intended to be a one way. There's got to be a. Oh, no. There's got to be a some kind of extended jump, whether it's just, you know, a high jump, or a double jump, or, or whatever, uh, some kind of ability we get to unlock. Um, I do kind of wonder what else you get. Yeah, you know, I'm still, I'd, I'd like to know, if you, can I get shields? I, I do have that other, other weapon slot. Um, I believe the club I got was two-handed, so I don't think I could use both. Uh, I'm just going to go back to the town uh, and heal um, because I decided to have a party in the spikes, which, you know, it's good times for everybody except my lower extremities. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, uh, uh, once again, my train of thought has derailed. Excellent. You have to excuse me. Um, I pretty much woke up and came to stream. <laughs> uh, which maybe wasn't the greatest idea. Although I'm playing okay. I think I'm actually playing better than I was playing uh, in the last episode. But uh, we won't talk about that. Oh, that's right. I have to find the recipes too. I don't even get them off the bat. Uh, I think I will level up. Yeah. Let's do some more damage. That sounds like an excellent idea. Alright, so where am I going here? Oh, I want to go back to the elevator. Uh, that one there, I couldn't jump. That other room. Hey, this map is different. I don't think it had the little connectors between rooms the same way. I think they were drawn different before. I'm not sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go to the elevator. It looks like there's some rooms I should explore. Uh, and probably have treasure or something in them. But some of them are also probably going to be uh, like dead ends. Except for this one. This one's got treasure in it. Uh, or not dead ends, I mean, but uh, potentially places I can't go. Uh, you know, where I need like the extended jump or whatever to proceed through them, um, or the ability to do something other than jump in spikes, uh, you know, I think last time there were, oh, ooh, ooh, yes, please, 
Well, if that isn't extremely Castlevania, I don't know what is. Uh, which is fine. Uh, I mean, you know, Castlevania is rather awesome. Um, especially like the DS ones. Um, I'm, I'm a pretty big fan. Which, of course, is part of why I was so excited for this game. Um, given that it pretty much markets itself as a, a Metroidvania. Um, and who doesn't like that? Uh, so, you know, I don't mind if they um, lift some stuff. Hopefully they have uh, new things, or at least will have new things, uh, as opposed to, to Castlevania. I don't think Castlevania ever had water. Uh, I, I didn't get through all of them. I, I got through, I think I got through all the GBA ones, like uh, Area of Sorrow and... I want to say Requiem for a Dream, but I think that's like some classical music. Uh, I can't, yeah, I can't remember the names of them all. Um, but I think there's two for the GBA that I've played through, and then I believe there's one for. Well, I think there's like three now for the DS, and I think I played a little bit through the first one. Uh, I don't think I finished it, so you know, I have no idea what what they have if they've introduced water, because um, certainly they. they they do evolve the game a little bit um, between each version, uh, or at least so I expect. I, again, I guess I haven't played them all, so I don't know. But well, that's fantastic. So I can go down the elevator now. Uh, yeah, but you know they're pretty good. Uh, so hopefully this will have some. Hopefully this will have some things that are, are unique to it. I, you know, I can't imagine it won't. Um, again, the water maybe is one of them. Um, and certainly it's a little bit different. Oh, here's the the uh, jungle place that I found that I can't go into. So i, I got to get to the other side of it. Um, oh, it's called the gardens. Hey, look at that. Okay, so the town is Carthus, and then the mines, of course, and then the gardens. Well, that's excellent. I threw an axe. So I do notice that my mana does not appear to be regenerating, which is most unfortunate. Um, hopefully, well, maybe not hopefully, I don't know. May maybe down the road, if uh, we're lucky or whatever you want to call it, we will get some kind of maybe a ring of health regeneration or some kind of ring of mana regeneration or whatnot. That'd be pretty cool. I cannot level up. Oh, I don't even get my mana back from the fire. Oh dear. So mana is a really precious resource. Interesting. So perhaps these red leaves, because uh, I think it's the three green leaves for... Did I have I found the, the recipe yet? I don't know how to find recipes that I know. Um, yeah, here's here's Triangle Head in his Lady Temple. Um, anyway, I, I believe the health potion recipe was three green leaves. So, oh, that was failure. So, I don't know. Uh, maybe the red leaves are used in like a mana potion or something. Uh, I mean, I, I would be surprised if I don't get a mana potion at some point. Um, but I'm not sure what... Uh, I'm not sure how common those red leaves are or, or whatever, and I'd have to have a spare bottle, which right now I don't. Um, I mean, certainly right now I'd much rather have a health potion than a mana potion, I think. But maybe if I'm lucky down the road, I can get a, like a heal spell or something. That would be kind of neat. Um, get a Cestus. got more damage than my sword, but I bet you it's super short range. It really is. I don't really think I ever want to use that. Although I don't think I really want to use my axe too much either. I don't want to burn out all my mana. Where am I going? This way. Uh, pardon me if you hear me sniffling a little bit. My nose is fairly uh, stuffy right now. Uh, 
trying to do my best to sniffle in a way that you can't hear it, but... It's one of those nasty crystal blue spikes. Um, we ran into a few of those in the last run through. I don't remember them being all that um, troubling or anything, but... <laughs> if I remember right, bats were one of the most annoying things just because they're so hard to hit. Um, I, they were a lot easier with the club because you've got that huge swing range. Um, you know, so it, oh, I didn't get a club, did I? I thought I got it from the troll last time. Maybe I did. Some of this stuff might be random. Um, or not random, a chance. You know, like uh, with luck, so maybe, maybe I ought to be putting some points into luck here, uh, which I haven't been doing. Uh, <clears throat> oh, no, I don't want to do that. But that gives me an opportunity to go get some essence. Hooray. Oh, jeez, I'm bad today. Alter last I think I had a I think I had three choices last time. I, I think I could sacrifice like two thousand as well or something. Um, but I only had five hundred last time and it gave me something that um, I can't remember what it was. It was a weapon or something and I seem to remember not even being all that you know impressive. Um, so maybe I need to save up for a thousand and get back there. Let's go back and explore um, Yeah, these bottom rooms below me. Um, yeah, so I, I want to save up for a thousand and use that altar because I, I couldn't. You couldn't do them all. You sort of only got one one option. Um, and like I said, I, I seem to remember. I keep pressing the wrong button. I seem to remember the uh, reward last time being. Uh, I seem to remember it being useless. Actually, I, I mean, it might have been cool if I didn't already get, uh, I, I can't remember, a piece of armor or something like that that was not as good as something I'd already gotten from an enemy. Um, that's going to be a boss. Is that going to be enough? When to go? I can't really call it a Malbarine. I don't know what the hell that's from. But, oh, yeah, he's going to knock rocks down at me. Oh, right, and then that. Ow. Ow. Ow, ow again. Okay, we want to stay away from you because fire. So, three abilities, maybe some equipment. Well, not maybe some equipment. It says right there, equipment. But you know what I mean. And some crystal. I have no idea. Oh, the crystals probably, like, unlock certain doors or something like that. That seems to be a, a not unlikely possibility. Oh, good. Oh, I can't craft anything yet. Can level up. Let's go with some luck. No, I'm going to save my essence for that, that, uh, altar. I would like to get that. Hello? Catacombs. Oh, this is a second area. Hmm. Interesting. Do I lose oxygen in there? I do. Ha! Well, that's kind of cool. Okay, well, there you go. Uh, yeah. 
that's new. I don't think there was anything like that in, in uh, <coughs> Castlevania. Fast enough to not get myself stabbed. I can't get back up. What have I done? Oh. Yeah, okay. So that's very like, like, oh, geez. Yeah. That's very like Prince of Persia. Oh, hey. This guy. Jesus. So magic penis orang. I'm sure they don't appreciate me referring to it as that, <laughs> uh, but I'm going to anyway, because it amuses me. Oh, I can't. Okay. I'm not sure I see this ending well. I'm kind of like in the middle of nowhere and, and I couldn't get back up. definitely don't have a heal potion and those spikes suck and these guys are creeping me out <sighs> that other guy dis oh hey power but that other guy disappeared all right okay we're good ledge grab aha okay so that's right <laughs> the arrow to the knee how about that Well, all right, so that's, oh, and that's why these little notches, eh, okay. So that's their version of like wall jump, extended jump and stuff. I, I mean, maybe I get the double jump later too, I don't know, but that's very interesting and also awesome. So I've unlocked the second power, which is cool because I'm only, uh, it looks like 37 minutes into this episode, uh, whereas last time I was, uh, I don't remember how long I messed around with, uh, a hardcore. Um, there were certainly some attempts in the first episode on that. A fair few, I think. Okay, on there. Um, you know, but uh, the second episode was a full hour of softcore plus at least a little bit uh, the first episode. So it feels like I'm, I'm uh, progressing quite a bit faster than I did the first attempts. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Why. Oh damn! I'm not entirely sure why. Just. Um, game perhaps. But that's cool, so that's that's at least the second unlock. Um, <clears throat> like I said before, it would be kind of neat if, you know, on some playthroughs you, you unlock it first uh, and have wall jump places around instead of uh, uh, kick slide places and then, and then unlock the kick slide second. Rat again! Why must I be terrible? Nope, doesn't look like I can do that. Okay, well, there was another path over this away somewhere I could go. So this, this, is that what I wanted? Yeah. Oh, I'll get this treasure. I guess I should complain about treasure. I mean, I'm getting something cool. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, something cool. However, now I guess I could leave the mines, but that doesn't seem like a good Hmm. Sorry, not the mines, the catacombs. Uh, I, I may be able to fully explore the mines now. I wonder if I can... Ha! Tricky. Okay. Got that sorted. Please be a campfire, please be a campfire, please be a campfire. Damn it. That, that, those guys are red. The other guys weren't red. 
be playing hardcore and everything would be okay. Well, everything would be okay until now. Oh my goodness. Well, you probably should be trying to go backwards rather than forwards, but no rest for the wicked or something. What kind of insane platitude I can throw in right there that makes any kind of sense. Sand is gonna fall. Wow, really? 55% explored? Oh, maybe that's just the, the part of the game that you can you can do. I, I don't. I don't like this at all. I don't like that. That's spinning the wrong way. I don't like this dude made of meat. These were all made of meat, but he's only meat. the edge. I didn't want to. I grabbed the edge. I got stuck. And then instead of jumping back up, I just dropped off the edge. And then, giant red, you died. Excellent. Okay, where am I? I'm at the door to the catacombs. I'm gonna go do a little bit of exploring. I would like to get some, some loots. I assume there is probably another boss or two in the catacombs. Um, and like when to go. Okay, hi. Oh, yeah, there we go. Ow. Mm, not a good start. Again. Alright. So we've lost. Oh, right, a pile of essence. That's one thing I want back, but we'll worry about that later. Jade Ring. Lifting belt is actually better than leather bracer, so I want to trade. Well, no, I don't want to trade anything. You do get your mana back when you die, so that's a plus, I guess. I, that's all mapped. I don't want to go that way. Yeah, there's those two rooms up there near the start. back there to explore that stuff. I don't know how interesting anything I'm going to get out of there is. Um, really, the only thing I really want at this point is like maybe a... Well, a new weapon would be okay. Maybe. Or, or a helmet. Because uh, I don't have one of those yet. Uh, oh, and the heal potion recipe. I don't have that yet either. Uh, which is unfortunate. I don't have enough to buy this thing. Where is that? That's right in the right above the catacombs path. Alright, I need to remember that. Oh, let's go explore. We'll go buy a potion, too. <coughs> that seems like a smart thing to do. And uh, aside from the parts when I fall in spikes and grab ledges when I meant to fall down, uh, I do try to to do the smart thing, um, or attack the wrong way at a bat, or jump on that dude's head. Okay, so maybe I don't try to do the smart thing, never mind, I take it back.
This is going to be one of them like long jump rooms with spikes at the bottom, and that'll be where I discover that you still can't jump far enough to grab the ledge in those particular rooms. Actually, I, I don't think you can. I don't think this was one of those rooms, but I, I don't think you can. So I, I've seen two uh, kinds of like long jump rooms or, or whatever, two, two rooms where um, previous to now at least I couldn't jump well enough to get to get through them. Um, and one of them has a huge pit of spikes and then a, a, a ledge jump or whatever after it and I don't feel like I could make it. I will certainly try if I find one unless I have like three health left, which is entirely possible by the time I get there. Um, but there was other rooms where you could just naturally almost, yeah this one, I, I don't I don't think I can make that. Let's find out. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay. Oh, I didn't take a full 15 damage there. I feel like I only took like 11. So, well, some armor. Maybe, maybe that's reducing it. That's cool. That's good. That's good. So where are we? room that I've already just bypassed. Damn it. Um, so apparently don't ever go traveling with me because it looks like I can't even read the simplest of maps. because those other ones don't have like the some of them have the red thing in the middle and some of them don't I, I think the ones with well maybe not because because well I don't know the one above the catacombs doesn't have a red thing and it doesn't have a campfire we know both um, but it does have that intermediate room that has the the uh, I don't know what's called altar the altar in it um, <coughs> that I need a thousand essence for Ooh, critical. Nice. What do we got here? See, I don't... No, I can make that without extra jump, so I don't... I could have just come here, I guess. Uh, huh. Failure. Oh, double failure. Triple failure. into a, a boss or something stupid up here. Uh, and not be able to do anything about it. Because I didn't go to town to get a heal potion, because I figured that campfire would be good enough to explore this little area. Uh, which was clearly a horribly mistaken assumption. other pile of essence I left wherever in the other place is probably all gone. So I really don't know. It'll all just hang around, I'm not sure. Um, I think I had like five or six hundred essence in it. Found a new room. Room two. I guess this is where I should have been right off the bat. I keep it, I guess. But I'd like to not die again. 
That would be wonderful. <clears throat> right, it's getting a little tense. Oh, so that's it. That's it, that's it. Okay, so... Maybe if we're really lucky, we can make it back to that campfire. Without running into something stupid. It should be possible. Now, I'm not sure I didn't look last time. Like I said, I, I, I do I observed that I do think I'm taking a little bit less damage from spikes. Uh, it seemed like it was 11 to me, but I'm, I'm really not sure. So I might be able to take one hit from spikes and not die right now. Uh, but just my luck, it would be exactly 12, uh, and I would die. So, let's not play with spikes. Let's not play with this dagger dude, either. I don't want his dagger in my face. going to use my herbs, my green leaves to make leaves to make a potion because I'm going to be going right past this thing anyway. Um, so I'm just going to go up and buy one for 100 essence because that seems like it is a better idea. Save my leaves for somewhere down the road. Is this the right way? No. What? No. It's dead end. Oh. Uh, thousand essence as well before we get back down to that altar area. At least if I stop dropping spikes. Okay. Hooray for safety. Oh, I can sell stuff to this dude. things. Hey, hey, we're very close to a thousand. Oh, except I'm going to spend some here, but still. Um, that's actually... Oh, right! Elevator dude is up here. Check out... I don't think we came back to him. Huh. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah. Oh, you can get shields. Well, that's interesting. Okay, so... Huh. Should have been a broadsword. Broadsword seems like something I really want. Um, chain hood. Ooh, those are getting expensive. Oh yeah. Oh, I need some essence. So, there's some cool stuff you can buy, by the way, apparently. Who knew? Uh, well, that's excellent. That's excellent, excellent. Okay, so I want to go way over to the right-hand side there. I don't know if it's worth exploring just for that one room. Um, yeah, it is, because I want to get a thousand thingies. And this is not where I want to be. Uh, I want to get a thousand uh, essence so that I can do that altar, and then I'll proceed from there. Oh, that was so close. Oh, these guys do have red faces too. I swear those other ones looked... Well, they, they must have been different because I, I'm one-hitting these guys, and that those other guys, even with 24 damage, took, took two hits. So they must be slightly different versions of themselves, but they both do have red faces, or... I, I, I don't really know. I'm not insane, honest. So in that one room there, that one room remaining in the first zone that I'm in, was 
does a, a super long jump with spike pits. And I can't, can't even try. Spike my feet all up. So we'll have to see. Uh, I mean, that may be a one way room, so maybe I come up to that from somewhere else at some point. Um, or possibly get some other ability that lets me do that. It'll be interesting to see. Close to a thousand. Except I'm not really. Oh, that room is right below me, actually. It is right there. Oh, that was my first axe kill. How about that? Well, I don't really want to go swimming through all the water into that other zone. I kind of want to. I'm gonna unlock this altar. Is there stuff to kill here? No, of course not. Oh, bad guy. Good. Almost exactly. Almost exactly. That's kind of oxymoronic, isn't it? Oh, that... I don't even know what I just did there, but I can't believe I didn't fall off. Alright, time to see what the altar brings. Magic Fireball. Well, that's kind of cool, I think. Maybe. I, I don't know. Yep. Yep. That's pretty cool. I, I will I will go with that. I don't really like the whole arcing axe thing. You know, I'm sure there's places where that's really useful and whatever. Uh, like there was in Castlevania. Um, and Rogue Legacy, actually, is a... An excellent game to, to bring up when you're talking about these types of games. Um, it's a little bit different. It's more like hard... Well, yeah, it's it's, it's definitely a, a different interpretation of this style of game, but it's, it's this sort of... I guess it's a platformer. I, yeah, yeah, there's a number of differences. But anyway, Rogue Legacy was a really good game. I actually enjoyed it. Um, although, again, it's a little bit different than this. Um, but it did have the the one of the special the spells you could get was the axe. Uh, the difference being your mana regenerated, except my mana just regenerated. What? Why did my mana regenerate? What did I do that did that? Fire doesn't regenerate it. Well, I don't know. But this is a good uh, uh, place as any to um, stop for this episode. Uh, I've been keeping them to an hour long. Uh, I don't know why. I just sort of picked an hour. Seems like a good number. Uh, and we're, we're right up to 59 minutes. So um, thanks for watching. Thanks for, for tuning in and, and uh, experiencing Chasm Alpha with me. I will try to um, pick up where I left off and uh, hopefully explore the remainder of... Um, whatever it's called, the catacombs, um, soon, uh, probably tomorrow, in fact, and uh, see if we can find another boss and possibly, you know, explore the remainder of this, because we're apparently 62% through. So, yeah, thanks again. 